What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, I'm going to be talking about the NFL Combine for 2020. Um, and basically going over some of the uh, participants. The Combine does start this week. Um, the on-field workout schedule, you can see it right here. Um, we've got tight ends, quarterbacks, and receivers from 4 to 11 p.m. Um, on Thursday. Then for on Friday... From uh, 4 to 11 p.m. again, we have kickers, um, special teamers, offensive line, and running backs. Um, Saturday from 4 to 11 p.m. again, we have D-line and linebackers. Sunday, we have uh, DBs from 2 to 7. Um, so with that, I'm going to go ahead and look at the uh, some of the participants. I've got it categorized by position. We're going to start at quarterback. Now, I have made videos on a lot of these guys, um, so feel free to go check some of those out. Um, I, haven't, I, I haven't gone into any other position as far as videos go, um, for, uh, other than quarterback. Uh, I, I've done videos on a lot of the quarterbacks. Uh, so we've got Kelly Bryant. I haven't done a video on him, but... Uh, maybe I will in the future. I don't know. Uh, Joe Burrow, of course. Jacob Beeson. Uh, Jake Fromm. Uh, Anthony Gordon. Justin Herbert. Jalen Hurts. Um, Jordan Love. Cole McDonald I actually did a video on too. Steven Montez. James, Mo yeah, James Morgan. Shea Patterson. Nate Stanley. And Tua Tagovailoa. Um, I did videos on most of those guys actually. Um, the only one, only ones of these I didn't do is Kelly Bryant, uh, Kevin Davidson, um, yeah, Brian and Jake, uh, Lutton. That's it. Um, I I've done videos on all the other quarterbacks here. Let's move on to running back. Um, also actually, before we do that, some of the things I'm looking forward to is, uh, of, of course, I want to see the passing drills for all these guys. I think a lot of these people can make a lot of money from here. Um, I think especially people like Jordan Love, I think if he really impresses on some of the passing drills, he can really up his stock a little bit. Um, so that's something we should definitely look for. Um, and it, also, some of the more mobile quarterbacks, I'm curious what their 40s are going to be. But I don't think any of these guys are like Lamar Jackson type of athletes. So um, don't expect anything too crazy. Running back, I I really like the running backs in, in this um in this class. You got Cam Akers out of Florida State, I really like him. Uh, Benjamin out of Arizona State, like him. AJ Dillon out of Boston College. D DK Dobbins out of Ohio State. Um, Zach Moss, I like Zach Moss a lot. Um, I don't usually like player comparisons, but he reminds me a little bit of uh, Alvin Kamara. Not necessarily his passing, like, like his receiving skills, but just his ability to bounce off of tacklers. It, it's kind of Alvin Kamara-esque. Um, people are labeling him as a power back, but I don't think so. Uh, I'll probably end up making a video on him eventually. I really, really, really like Zach Moss. Um, Michael Prime, Brian, I, I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, DeAndre Swift, J.J. Taylor, Jonathan Taylor. Keyshawn Vaughn. It's actually a pretty good uh, little running back class. Um, and, of course, uh, 6'4", 270 Clyde. Um, if you want to know why I, I say that, it's, it's because of, of a press conference with Ed Ogeron, LSU's head coach. He's always going to be 6'4", 270 Clyde to me. But, uh, yeah, moving on to receiver. Uh, I haven't gone super deep into a lot of these positions yet. Um, so yeah, I, I mean, I do so, I do know some of the big names, but not all of them yet. Uh, Tony Brown, Tyree Cleveland, I, I, I know him a little bit. Um, KJ Hamler, I, I like him out of Penn State. T Higgins is good. Uh, KJ Hill. Justin Jefferson from LSU is really good. Van Jefferson. Jerry Judy is fantastic. I really want to see his uh, his route running. 
Oh, I didn't even see that there was a second page. Uh, Jawan Johnson. I'm going to go back and look at running back and quarterback in a second. Make sure there wasn't other people. Um, C.D. Lamb. Michael Pittman at a USC. Jalen Rager. I really like Jalen Rager. Henry Ruggs. I really am curious to see what his 40 time is going to look like because he's fast as shit. Um. All right. Let, let me let me go back to uh, quarterback real quick. Make sure there wasn't okay. Running back. Okay. Just make it sure. Tight end. I don't know too many tight ends yet. I'll be honest. Um, mainly because I don't really like watching tight ends that much. Um, let me see. Jared uh, Pinckney. I know him a little bit out of Vanderbilt. Thaddeus Moss, of course, from LSU. Um, uh, Mitchell Wilcox, I know a little bit at a USF just because he's a local person. Um, I live right outside of Tampa, so. But let me know um, any and any of these tight ends that I should like really take a look at because honestly, I don't really care that much about tight ends. Like I'm gonna watch them eventually, but. Uh, it's probably going to be one of the later positions I look at. Go over to O-line. Um, Becton, I really, really like him out of Louisville. I like him a lot. That dude is massive. He's mean. I, I, I like him. Um, I don't have a full opinion on him yet because I haven't like full-on watched the film. I've only seen him in passing, but I do like him. Um, Nick Harris, Joshua Jones, yeah, this is of course going to be more for offensive line. Um, Jedrick Willis, yeah, I like him out of Bama. Let me see. There any more? No, no more alignment. Okay, um, I'll, I'll start to know more of these guys eventually. It's still kind of early in the draft process, and some of these positions I've actually been kind of waiting for the combine. D line, Derek Brown. Um, I'll probably end up making a video on him, so I'm not gonna get into the uh, my opinions on him. I do like him though, but. I, I, I think people are hyping him up a little bit too much. I'll, be, I'll say that. But I do like him. And I do see him as a uh, first-round pick still. But I think some people are hyping him up a little bit too much. Uh, he is a very good one tech though. Um, Raekwon Davis, it feels like we've been watching him for forever. AJ Epinesa, I really like him a lot. Um... Not really sure what to do with him. I'll probably end up making a video about that, talk about it more. He plays defensive end right now, but I would put him in at 3-tech in like a 4-3 type scheme. Uh, Licky Fotu, yeah. Jonathan Greenard, yeah. I, I, I kind of like him out of Florida. Some um, pretty good technique, actually. Trayvon Hill, Javon Kinlaw. I really, really like Javon Kinlaw. He might be my favorite defensive lineman in this class so far. Um, obviously Chase Young is probably the best, but I, I, I have some things to say about uh, Chase Young too, but um, that'll come later. Yeah, there he is too, Chase Young. Um. I'm probably gonna be making a video on him too. Uh, I do, I, I do like him. Don't I don't want it to sound like I don't like him because he's a very, very good player, um, very, very talented pass rusher. But I, I do have some problems with him. Still, should be like a top five pick though. Um, Jason Strobridge, yeah. Okay. 
Chauncey Rivers. I know him. Um, but a lot of these guys. Oh, oh, I didn't even see him. Uh, Jabari Zuniga. Yeah, the other guy from Florida, uh, Senior Bowl guy. Moving over to Edge. Okay. I mean, I guess that makes sense because you just put it all on defensive line. Uh, linebacker, not too familiar with the linebackers yet either. Uh, Marcus Bailey out of Purdue, yeah. And also, uh, the um, the combine is also a good start for me to find some of these guys too. Um, if they do really well, sometimes I'll write their names down to watch later. Uh, I, I don't make videos on everybody, but... Um, Malik Harrison, yeah. Terrell Lewis out of Alabama. I like him. Michael Pickney. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I meant. Uh, David Woodyard, yeah. Isaiah Simmons. I, I love me some Isaiah Simmons, let me tell you. Uh. Haven't dove real deep into the film just yet, but man, do I like Isaiah Simmons. Um, very, very underrated player. You, there's a, so much you can do with him, but I'll probably get into that later too. Uh, corner. Don't know that many corners or uh, defensive backs yet. Uh, I really do like to let um, the combine happen before I look at defensive backs. Mainly because film is really hard to find on defensive backs, and sometimes the drills can really help um, kind of paint the picture of what you're looking for. Uh, some positions, the the drills really aren't that important to me, especially like running back. But even running back, uh, certain some of the drills are important. But defensive back, it's really important to me because I need to see how well they turn and stuff like that. Um, yeah. Trayvon Diggs out of Bama. Uh, Kristen Fulton. He's getting a lot of attention, but I kind of think he, he he has a potential to kind of slide a little bit. Um, but I guess we'll see. Hopefully he has a good day at the Combine. Harrison Hand. Jeff Okuda, of, of course. He's He's fantastic. Um, the only true lockdown corner to me in this draft. Those are very, very hard to find, and he's fantastic. Um, not that many corners. AJ Terrell out of Clemson. Okay, move over to safety. Julian Blackman. Grant Delpit. Uh, I, I like Grant Delpit. Um. I know a lot of people are really questioning him because, like, people are really hype on him, like, during the season. But now it seems like people are kind of turning on him a little bit, saying he has tackling problems, which he kind of does. Um, he is a willing tackler. It's not that he's not willing, but he he does get run over a little bit. But he covers really well, he moves really well, and he reads the field. Um, if you uh, – I don't know how much film I'm going to watch on him or at least uh, show – but generally speaking, from when I see, what, what I see of him, when the play is in front of him and he has a chance to read the field, he's pretty solid and he does make tackles. But um, when he has to react, uh, he, he can get ran over sometimes. So what that means to me, he should, play, he ju he should just be a full-time free safety. Uh, don't put him in the box. Don't make him a box safety. Just let him play free safety. Let him play with the range. Let him read the field and make plays for you. If you do that, I think he can be a pretty good player. So, yeah. Brandon Jones out of Texas, yeah. Xavier McKinney. Um, if you're looking for a strong safety, uh, Xavier McKinney, to me, is your guy. Um, I think he is better in the box than he is at free safety. But he can play free safety for you. He can. J.R. Reed out of Georgia. Antoine Winfield, yeah. Okay. Um, I'm, I doubt I'll know any of these guys, but I'll take a look. Um, there's only three kickers. Okay. A lot of punters, though. Oh, I actually do know Tommy Townsend. I, I do know him. 
Uh, but yeah. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, I'd appreciate you hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.